Okay, so let's start by paying homage to the Buddha. <clears throat> Namo dasa bhagavato arahato sama sambo dasa Namo dasa bhagavato arahato sama sambo dasa Namo dasa bhagavato arahato sama sambo dasa So uh, last time we studied how to form the imperative verb in Pali. So to form the imperative verb, so we need to know the imperative mood of our terminations. Okay. So imperative mood of terminations are uh, only, you know, that person singular plural and then second person singular are different from the present tense. The rest are, you know, the same as the present tense. Okay, so do and do, he, ta, me, ma. Okay, do and do, he, ta, me, ma. So, okay, uh, we already know that. So we have the, you know, four kind of base, power bases. <clears throat> so you now ending in the R, uh, like the Dawa, and the ending in the R, uh, like the Kina, and the ending in the O, like the, you know, Garo. And the ending in the A, like the uh, D, C, okay? So these bases. Uh, you know, last time we already learned the, uh, the bases Da, Wa, ending in the, you know, A. So just adding those, the Baba termination, imperative Baba termination, to that base, dawa do, dawa and do. Okay, and the dawa ta, dawa mi, dawa ma. But here in the second person singular, so related to the second person singular, he, so we have the, you know, special form for the a uh and the a uh ending. So for the a uh and a uh ending, so can be you know, ahi form. So ah become long. And also just the same as the base form, da wa. So by dropping, you know, that bubble termination hit. So that is why. So we have the two form, don da wa hi da wa. So in this way, don da wa hi da wa. Okay, so the same way for the R ending also, uh, already R, if we add the he, so R he form, but if we elide or if we drop the he, so R also becomes short, so R form. So that is why, you know, ki na, he, ki na, the same as the R ending, 
Dawahi Dawa and then Kinahi Kina. Okay. So Dawahi Dawa and then so Kinahi Kina. <clears throat> so Dawahi Dawa Kinahi Kina. So, so now I end in, uh, so I end in, so ki na so ki na do and then no ki na do so ki na he and then another form ki na and then for plural, so ki na ta. And then ki na me. So ki na ma in this way. So the same as the present tense, but in the second person singular, so we have the two form ki na hi ki na. Okay. Ki na hi ki na. The same way in the A ending also, uh, we have the two forms. So, Dawahi, Dawa. Okay, Dawahi, Dawa. So now, uh, <clears throat> the, you know, all ending, like the Karo. So, we have the Karo to. And then Karon to but Karo he only one form. So Karo ta and then Karo me and then Karo ma. Okay. So Karo do Karon do Karo he Karo ta Karo me Karo ma. And then now. So A and in DC. So DC do. DC do. So DC he. DC ta. And then DC me. DC ma. Okay. So now I end in, okay. So our ending is dawa. That is sign dawa do and dawa do. So dawa he dawa and then dawa ta. So dawa me. And then for plural, so da wa ma. Ki na base. Okay. So in this way, only in the a ending and the a ending. So we have the two form, you see. Here R and the base ending in the R. So in the second person singular, we have the two forms. But the rest are the same. Karo also only Karo he. Okay. And then DC also only Karo ma. 
So they say he only they say he. So in this way, the same form. So that is how to form the imperative buff in Pali. So only in the second person singular for R ending and the R ending. So we have the two form. In this way, we have the two form. <clears throat> and then, so to translate them into English. So here three way. So using the, you know, uh, imperative verb terminations, you know, may or let, okay? So, here, da, wa, do. So, so, da, wa, do, or da, wa, do. So, using, you know, may. So, he may run, or may he run, or let him run. Okay, so three possibility to translate that imperative verb into English. He may run also, or may he run also, let him run also. One of them is okay, actually, to translate, you know, Pali but into English. But we need to know all of ways, all of method. Because, so when we see, maybe, you know, in English, let him run. So at the time, so we need to understand, oh, that is so dawad do. Or may he run also, so dawad do. Or he may run also in Pali, so dawad do. Okay, that's not, but you know, vice versa, English into Pali or Pali into English. So that is a, all of these three ways are important to know. So the same way, you know, they, da, one, do, that by same plural, you know, they may run, may they run, and then let them run. Okay, just plural is different. They may run, may they run. Let them run. Okay. Any question? Sandal here. Yes. Sandal, so may they run? How to say in Myanmar? Do do be vazi. Okay, bye, Sandal. Thank okay, you, Sandal. Okay. Okay. And then for the second person singular, so duan da wa, actually duan da wa he, so a true form possibility. So duan da wa he or da wa. So for that also, so you may run or may you run, but let you run is a little bit strange in English. So maybe that one also possible too, but so no rarely used in English. So instead, so we use as a command run or go. So without translating, you know, subject. Without using the subject as a command, go, go, walk, walk, eat, eat, do it, like that. <clears throat> so that is why in the second person singular, you may run, may you run, and then, you know, run. Okay. So the same way, second person plural also, may you run, you may run, and the run. But for the uh, past person singular, hand dawa me, so I may run, may I run, so let me run. Okay, three possibility to translate into English. And then for plural, may dawa ma, so we may run, may we run, and the let us run. Okay, let us run. So that is how you know, ki na do. So may he buy, he may buy, let him buy in this way. And the karo do, may he do, he may do, may he do, or let him do. In this way, let him make. And they say to, or they say he. So may you expound, or you may expound, or expound. Okay. So in this way. So 
Now, that is common or formal or regular uh, conjugation of those verb with the imperative. So now, uh, irregular root is especially uh, root as. Root as a very irregular in Pali, you know, to be. So in the present time also, you see, you know, as d to the, you know, active, right? And the as and the and so to the sandy, that is present tense. Okay, in present tense. Just review it. And then to the as, by adding, you know, C, so SC to the, you know, SC. The as to the as by adding the verb termination as to the, you know, at. And then ask me, so M me, and then ask ma, so M ma. So that is, uh, you know, the last, Three forms will be the same as the, you know, present tense in the imperative. Because the same as the present tense, right? By the termination, you see. Theta and me and ma are the same. That is, and their form also will be the same with the root us. <clears throat> So now, uh, imperative. So with the root as. So do and do he tell me ma. So for the uh, that bus in singular root is as. Uh, to the as, you know, we add it to. So as to. So here also. You know, sada is changed to the data. So that is how we have the, you know, add to. So we have the add to. So add to. Also. Uh, we can translate. He may be or may he be or you know let him be so in this way three possibility and then so root us to the root us we add the and to so now, so ascend to, so from the ascend to, you know, this R is drop. That is how we have the, you know, sand to, okay? Sand to also, they may be, or may they be, or let them be, like that. And then, Now root us, so root us to the he. So to the root us by adding he. So us he. But here is that and ha, double consonant, we don't use together. So instead, you see, so here, So, sa is drop, okay? Sa is drop, and the a become loud. So, uh, so we can say, so from the as, 
you can the R and this R to the you know R. Okay, so firstly, you know, sa gets draw. So that is why we have the you know R he form. R he. Okay, so you know I to send to and the R he. So the rest are uh, the same as the you know present tense. Ru as to the root as by adding the ta. So as ta and from the as ta become the at ta. So sa ta become the you know da ta at ta. The same way you know root as and me. So we have the as me and then you know and me. So root as by adding the ma. So we have the as ma and then another form is you know and ma. So in this way. Okay. So that is why uh, we are forming is very uh, similar to the you know present tense only in the second person singular second person singular are he this one is very special okay so now we almost finish we almost finished the we are forming the imperative bar imperative bar so but you see in the note number 20 so actually note number 19 i already explained so he so before the domination he find it out of the base so land it as the ah so da wa he land it as the ah you see da wa he and then Optionally, the, this bubble termination is dropped. So at that time, only as a base, da wa. So here you see, and da wa he da wa. So the same way, you know, uh, ending in the r also, r becomes short. And also, so here two forms of ki na he, ki na. Okay, this one I already explained. So that is ask it. <clears throat> now, so uh, we are using that imperative bar for the negation, uh, prohibition, prohibition. So maybe to prohibit, not to do something, don't do that, or don't go there like that. So as a, a kind of the negative command, so prohibition is negative command, don't do, don't go, don't eat, don't run. So for that sense, so we use the, you know, particle ma, the particle ma. So this ma, is uh, actually don't, not just not, don't. So that ma also here, So ma plus, so imperative bar. Ma plus imperative bar. Or don't. So bar infinitive. Don't bar infinitive. So like this. So don't go. Or don't run, you know, and so on. So to say that point, we use and also maybe at the time, you know, if we say don't go, don't run and so on. So at the time that is, you know, 
uh, how do the second pass thing. Uh, so for example, you know, rapidly we can say, so ma, so da we do, ma da we do. So at that time, he may not run. Or may he not run. Or so let him not run and so on. Okay. So in this form, we cannot see that. So don't sense just negative sense. You see, ma. But in the second person, singular or plural. So ma da wa he. So at that time, we have this sense. You know, don't run. Only that one. Don't run. That is how you know commonly we see so ma is used prohibition ma is used for not just negative sense maybe a uh, partly partially you know the a kind of command sense is included that is how you know we see the prohibition <clears throat> okay that is uh the particle ma uh, using with the imperative above is red prohibitions. Yeah, ma gacha, ma gacha is. So don't go. So now, uh, actually, you know, in this lesson, so imperative move especially, but now, uh, so to extend the sentence structure, so we need to know some of the adverbs, some of the adverbs. Okay, so here you see demonstrated adverbs and the relative adverbs and the interrogated adverbs. Okay, so those are uh, derived from the, you know, pronouns, pronouns. Okay, so to understand this thoroughly, or, uh, you know, systematically, we need to know uh, in this way. Uh, the first one is, you know, So demonstrated pronoun. So demonstrated pronoun is two kinds. One is, you know, da in Pali. So da me, you know, that. And then second one is, you know, ima. So ima means this. Okay. So uh, to the that pronoun, demonstrated pronoun, by adding the same, you know, suffix, some suffix. So here, some suffix are, you know, uh, dara, and the ta, okay? So these suffixes are, uh, how to say, uh, they express the location, locations. Dra ta. Okay. So now to the ta. So we add the you know, tara. So we have the uh, ta tara. So ta tara means, you know, location. So to denote the location commonly, so we use the these preposition uh, at, in, or 
own um, plus location, right? So that is why now ta. So that ta means in that place, in that location, in that place. So that means no there. So the same way, you know, to the ta by adding the, you know, uh, ta ta. So we have the, you know, ta ta. So here also literally means in that place, actually. But, so that means, you know, there as a single word. So the same way if we understand, you know, this, uh, that, that, uh, that uh, how it is formed. So they are derived from the, you know, demonstrated pronoun by adding the, you know, some suffix. So it are entire uh, suffix for the location. So at the time we have the, you know, locate adverb. That uh, and that are uh, locate adverb. <clears throat> so the same way, so here ima. So ima mean this, but that ima is you know changed to the sometime e, sometime a, sometime e, but the same meaning. In that form, so look at elva. So that is why you know now ima. So to the ima by adding the you know tara. Okay, so now this ima is a uh, change to the a. Uh. So instead of saying change, so actually contracted. So i e is dropped, only a uh, remain. So that is an a uh, remain. So we have the, you know, adra uh, form. So this adra uh, also uh, basically or uh, literal meaning. So in so this tra is located, uh, you know, elevable suffix, okay, that is why. So in place or in location, but I mean this, so that is why, you know, in this place. So that means, so here, as a single elevable. So add tara, and then, so e ma, so this e ma to the e, uh, actually, so this ma is get dropped, so it remain, this e is changed to the e, and to the e, so data is added, so we have the, you know, eta. So here also actually the same meaning in this place or here. Okay, here. So in this way we form these, you know, local adverb. <clears throat> so from the, uh, that demonstrated pronoun. So, and then now another, the, So suffix is da. So this da is only, you know, with the ima, uh, demonstrative pronoun ima, not with the da. So that is fine. So ima, so to the ima, we add the, you know, da. So at that time, ima is reduced or contract it as the e. So now we have the e dot form. Okay. And also, so in this da, so this da, so become silent. So that is another form is e ha. Also here, 
in this way, Ida or Iha here. So these are uh, uh, loke erva. Okay, loke erva. So the same way, uh, okay, head is so. Look at Eva. And then now, so relative pronoun. So relative pronoun is, so we have the only ya in Pali. So ya mean, so you know, what, what or which or something. what or which just to relate to connect sentences the relative any demonstrated pronoun or definite clause and indefinite clause to join we use that relative pronoun so from the, that relative pronoun so using those the suffix are uh, you know there are and the data and then another form is hey okay the same one these are also look at adverb look at surface so at in on and the location so that is why to the ya I added the, you know, tara. So we have the, so yat tara. So yat tara also here, uh, literally, you know, in which place? So that means, you know, where? The same way to the ya. So we have the, you know, yata and to the ya by adding the heim, we have the, we have the, you know, ya hey. The same in a way. Okay. Ya heim. So yadra, yata, ya heim. So, and then, now the interrogative pronoun for question. Interrogative pronoun for question. So we have the came, okay. So this came is, uh, okay, the meaning of came is you know uh so question wh question so this came also uh sometimes change to the ga and uh, sometimes change to the you know ku. okay ga and the so, and then, so we use these suffix. So for the location, 
the nodara and the ta and the he and the ham for the location So, to the K by adding the, you know, uh, Tara. So, K is changed to the Ku. So, we have the, you know, Ko Tara. Ko Tara also in which place, but the where. But question. Different from the, you know, so relative pronoun. Relative pronoun is just to relate to sentences. But here, you know, just to ask question for the location. So, came to the car and then ta. So, we have the, you know, kata. Also, where. And then came. Change to the ku and then heim is added. So ku hei. The same way k change to the ka and then ham sape is added. So kaham. The same meaning where. So that is why, you know, by adding these, so local surfaces, local adverb surfaces, by adding to the, those, you know, demonstrative pronoun, we have the local adverb, and uh, to the relative pronoun, we have the local adverb for relation, and then to the interrogative, interrogative pronoun, by adding these, so local adverb surface, we have the, you know, local adverb for question. So, okay. Okay, raise your question. Sierra Kutra, Kuhin, Kuhan, these three works, uh, the meaning is a four is a interrogative of the relative pronoun. Uh, interrogative, the same as the first. Okay, thank you, thank you Sierra. Okay, okay. And then next. Yes, you can. Uh, yes. Uh, Bande, can I understand a bit more like the um the, the kutra, the kata, and the kuhim, and the kuhang, and all these. Uh, when when to use what? And uh, okay, okay, when to continue. use which one? Uh, so actually, they are synonymous. They are synonym. Any one you can use. The same meaning where? Question. Asking for place. I see. Thank you. Okay. So, okay, these are actually for local adverb. So now, uh, so, but in Parliament, easy some forms are, you know, uh, mixing, mixing together. You see, a do, e do, da do, and the ya do, and the ku do. But meaning is different. So this, uh, okay. So now you know. So the surface door also we can use the surface door, but so that the surface door has you know uh, from sense. So that means 
you know, from which location, from which place, from place, like that, from location, not at all in sense. So for example, I come from this place or, you know, I depart from this place to another like that. So from sense is included in the door, but the other surface like the dara, ta, he, and ha, have these sense add on in. But here, you know, from sense. So from, and then location. So now with the ta and the by adding door, we have the ta door. Okay. So ta mean that, but door mean from locations. So literally it means so from you know that place. Literally from that place, that means, you know, from there, not just there, from there, okay? So the same way, uh, ima, by adding to the ima, by adding the door. So we have the, you know, a door, ima is changed with the a. Another form is ima change the e e do the same meaning. So literally from this place, but it means from here. Okay. So that is for the demonstrated pronoun, and now for the the relative pronoun also. To the ya by adding the do, we have the, you know, ya do. So ya do means, so from where? No question, not for question, just to relate. So, so I go there from where they come, in that sense. I go there from where they come. In that sense, to, to, to relate two sentences, we use the ya do. Not asking, okay, to relate to sentences. So from where? No, that is a no question mark, you see? No question mark. But, so K means interrogative by adding the door. So K is chained to the ku. So ku do. Also from where? Okay, but question to ask. So, good dog don't argue chessy like this. Good dog don't argue chessy. So, that means from where do you come? So question, you see, because of good. But if we use yado do agitasil, where you can. So different between these kudo and yado. If we use so yado don agitasi mean just where you can. Okay, so different between the kuto and the yato. So, okay, these are local adverb. Local adverb. So, and then now, so to uh, these uh, demonstrative pronoun, uh, relative pronoun, and the interrogative pronoun by adding the same service we can form the the temporal adverb also temporal adverb adverb of time so 
uh, temporary adverbs are uh, suffix, uh, you know, da. And the dani and the da chen da chen. So that means for the time. Okay, temporary adverb. So to the da by adding the da. So we have the the da. So the da me, you know, then or at that time. At that time or, you know, then. So this with the da, only da is used. We don't have the da ni form or the da jannan form. Only the da form with the da. Okay, and then so for the ima, so we use the dani. So ima is called as the e. So that is how we have the so e dani. Okay, so e dani me, you know dani me at time. Okay, the meaning of those are at time. So ima mean this. So at this time. Okay, that mean now. At this time or now. And then with the relative pronoun, ya, also we use only da for. So we have the yada. So at what time? Not question. So that means when. And then now, uh, so with the interrogative pronoun came. So by adding the da, so k become the ka. So ka da, ka da. Also, at what time? That question. That means when. Also question. And then another form is k. And then we have the da jenna suffix. So at the time came is changed to the ku. So ku da jenan. Also the same meaning. At what time? Question or when? No question. So in this way, we form you know, some the uh, local adverb or temporal adverb by adding those surface. Uh, to the pronoun demonstrated or relative or interrogative pronoun. So we have those adverb. But in Pali means easy. So, you know, without explaining or without separating systematically in this way, some adverbs so demonstrate, uh, you know, adara, ita, ida, and the iha, tadara, dehe. And ado, ito, tato, and relative pronoun, yata, yata, yehin, yado. Interrogative pronoun is kudra, kata, kuhin, kahan, kudo. In this way, and then here meaning, adra, eta, ida, iha, me here, tadra, data, dehe, mean there, and so on. Okay. But, so if we understand in this way systematically, so easy to remember, uh, easy to form by ourselves. So, and then generally those adverbs stand before above. So ad, they are adverbs 
that is uncommonly with both them in the sentence before about in Pali. So here, uh, adra wasami, I live here. And then, ahan ito kachami, I go from here. So in this way, so before the kachami bab, here we see ito adverb. So before the wasami bab, so here we see the adra adverb. So commonly, generally, that is just general saying, general speaking. Not exactly. Okay, the next, let's see, power number 22 are how they are related or how they are used in the sentence widely. Okay, for the relative adverb. Okay, this one should be for next time. So because it one also need to be explained widely. Okay, so now already one hour. So any question for this lesson? <clears throat> Can I ask questions? Yes. Uh, I see some translation, Tatra, they said, uh, uh, translate to then, become yeah. the time frame, Tatra. Okay. Some translation, I see they, they translate it to then. Is uh, it Tatra? Yes, possible, but so basically, so there are me advabious sense, the, the look at advabious sense, basically, but sometimes based on context, so we can understand their meaning. Now, so we are, are learning the, you know, basic information, that is why I, I divide in this way, but later, you know, based on their contextual sense, we can understand their meaning rightly. Oh, yes. Thank you, Bandit. Okay. And then, any more question? Bandit? Yeah. Can I ask a question which is not related to today's lesson? Is okay. it okay? Okay, it okay, does. never mind. Yeah. Bante, this is uh, based on the uh, lesson one, mm -hmm. uh, the verb vasati, he dwells. Lesson one, vasati. Okay. So vasa has ended and I see some people posted the spelling of vasa V A S S A. Is it correct? Ah, uh, so that is Wasati. Wasati means to rain. It rains. Oh, so what was what's the difference, Bante? So so Vasa? here sing, uh, sing it, you know, mm -hmm. uh, sing it, sa and the diverse, sa. So let's see in the dictionary. Yeah, yeah, that one is uh, important to know for us. Oh, sorry. So, firstly, was set D. So, okay, what said the here, uh, the first was said the was me and uh, two clothes water. Okay, not this one. And second, second was said the is to live, to dwell, to stay. So here, a single sa, you see, was said the. So, okay, for the that bar with the diverse sa. So, what said the? Oh, so, so what said the is maybe in sense of reach. So that is uh, where Kalina was said the. 
so to rain you see to rain or so to shower or to pour in this and so on okay thank so, you Bansi. okay root was and root was so any question so okay you can ask not only about this let let sense of previous also if you will uh understand or something uh, not clear to you uh, wonder me bante mm -hmm. uh, i would like to ask about at the, the previous lesson mm -hmm. can bante show the example in the sutta because at the have the come and go is same meaning yes maybe maybe i can have the example in the sentence so okay uh, that one also let's see in the dictionary so for the a t So A T. So uh, that A T. So if we take, you know, just from the E, root E. So at that time also A T. So we get the two go. Okay, but with the R prefix, so at that time R and E together also become. So E that A T is you know to come. Uh, in the example, you see. Uh, so Surya atan inten. So inten also here. Yeah, that is uh, maybe present participle form. We won't. We we will not. Uh, we have not learned yet. So maybe uh, in lesson fifteen, or uh, no, no, lesson twenty or twenty one, we will learn. So inten is present participle. So when the sun is going to the end, so that means when the sun is setting. So as I can hear, in then A is you know just in the sense of going. But so very common what? So we family, you know, so the Buddha calling those his disciples, so ehi beku. So come a monk. So at the time, maybe a monk, so listener, the mat listener, he is even though a man, lame by sin, but maybe because of his part merit past merit so after listening to the demo of the blessed one so he is wanted to be called ehi beku and then the voters address this one ehi beku at that time his form also automatically changed uh, as a, a monk so in that word ehi is so combination of the r and the ed and then here imperative but ehi so come so imperative a he second person singular you see mm -hmm. the second person singular imperative but come a, a kind of comment or a kind of you know gentle advice mm -hmm. okay Okay, any question else? Mm -hmm. So, no more question. So, let me stop here by saying sad three times. <clears throat> okay, so sad.
Sadhu, Sadhu. Thank you, Bande. Thank you, Bande. Thank you, Bande. Good night. Mm -hmm. Good night. Good night, Bande.